In this video, I'll show you how to design your life journal in Notion. Besides my daily reflection, I can also check my daily highlight, which is the task of the day. I can also check my daily moods, energy levels, and how productive I am on a scale of 1 to 10. Opening a new page in Notion, I'll first give the page a name and an icon. Then I'll turn it into full width. I then add a new table view called Entries. And I'll hide the database title and the vertical lines for a minimal look. Then I'll delete the default text property and pages. I first add a date property that will be the date of this entry. Then I'll add a text property to write down my daily highlight, which I will give it a new property icon. Now I will add a new entry as an example. Following, I will add a mood database which I will use a gallery view. I will hide the database title, turn off the card preview, and change the card size to small. I will add as many pages as I need for my different modes and customize the color and icons that best represents it. I will now add a heading block above each database view to label them. Now, I will add a relation property between the entries and modes database. This allows me to choose from the different modes I created earlier. I will duplicate the modes database to do the same for energy levels. I will remove the access pages as I will only need 3 pages for high energy, medium energy, and low energy. I should see a new relation on the entries database. I will just rename it to energy level and give it a new icon. Moving on, I will add a number property to check my productivity level from a scale of 1 to 10. I will choose to show it as a ring, optimize it to the color I prefer, and choose to divide by 10. Now I will create different views for the entries database. First, I have a today view to filter for today's entry. Then I will duplicate it to create a view to show entries for this week. I will just need to update the filter to fix that. Lastly, I will have another view that will use the calendar layout, which allows me to have an overview of all my entries. For writing in my daily journal and reflection, I can create templates to generate pre-written questions and prompts. Go into creating a new template for entries database, and then I will give this template a name. On the page body, I can write the questions or prompts to guide my daily journaling. Now if I go back to open any entry page, I can see the option to use the template I just created. I hope you found this video helpful, and please comment below what tutorial I should do next. Fearless.